Hello everybody, I am Mode West, and this is Near Automata once again. And apparently by clicking on the screen, I have selected to play as A2 this time. Commencing support of Unit A2. So, yep. That's what we're doing. I was gonna make that choice anyway, instead of going even further down 9S. Activation of Unit A2 confirmed. Good morning, A2. What, not gonna tell your pod good morning? Who are you? Tactical support unit pod 042. This pod has been tasked with providing firing support for your high unit A2. Uh -huh. I didn't ask for help. Well, you got it. No request was received from Unit A2. Rather, it was the final order from this pod's previous support assignment, Unit 2B. <laughs> well, it's unnecessary. Your high Unit A2 lacks the authority to override this order. Shit. Whatever. Well, stuck with a pod. And I'm pretty what the damn. What is that uh, huge thing? Unknown. You're pretty useless, you know that? Anyway, like I was saying, I'm pretty sure this bridge was destroyed in the cutscene when the tower popped up. Proposal. Unit A2 should state her intentions. No. Why the hell would I do that? In order to provide optimal support, pods must be supplied with data relating to the activities of supported units. <laughs> Not happening. Well, all right then. That's good to know. Save real fast in case I end up dying horribly. Which is very possible. So, I guess I'll just head off to the tower then and see what A2 thinks of it. That could be interesting. Could actually be a primary objective that I don't know about. Of course, you would expect it to be an objective, considering that it's a huge fucking tower that wasn't there before. Proposal. Unit A2 should state her intentions. Again? What did I just say? If an attending support unit is not provided with data related to the activity of its target, it is programmed to automatically repeat the request every 30 seconds until such data is made available. Are you kidding me? Proposal. <laughs> unit A2 should state her intentions. Needlessly repeating conversations on the same topic is a waste of energy resources. You're the one who keeps talking. And 30 seconds from now, Unit A2 should state her intentions. You know it's gonna happen. The pod just warned you that it's gonna happen, so until you tell it your intentions, you can expect it to happen again, lady. But I'm pretty sure the first objective you get as A2 sends you out to the desert. So I should head in that direction. 30 seconds have passed. Yes, they Proposal. have. Unit A2 should state her intentions. Stop! My intention is to beat the hell out of every goddamn machine I can find. Is that enough for you? Affirmative. Scanning and marking of nearby machine life forms complete. Goliath class enemies detected in desert area. Proposal. Well, that's where we're going. Goliath class enemies should be destroyed. Don't tell me what to do. Pods are not authorized to issue commands. Proposals are merely recommendations based on data provided by Unit A2. Uh -huh. Unit A2 should state updated intentions in order to secure more usable data. Shut the hell up. Negative. All right. This pod is engaging in activity based on the final order of Unit 2B. Your high Unit A2 lacks the authority to issue commands. Look, just stay out of my way. Affirmative. All right, so you done talking? Good. Gonna talk to Emil, but you gotta shoot him first to make him stop. And guess I can't talk because reasons. Okay, now I can talk. Ugh, ow, ow, ow. You could have just asked me to stop, you know. I tried, but it didn't work. Hey, you're A2, aren't you? It must be fate that we ran into each other, and since you're here, you might as well buy something. Yep. Emil runs a shop. 
That is very nice. So... Huh. Okay, yeah. I don't feel like actually buying any of this stuff. I look forward to serving you again. What was that? You want to know where I live? No. Well, I live deep, deep underground. Picture something deep, then go deeper. Feel free to visit me anytime you want. Yeah, so... Could have definitely ran into him a lot earlier in the game, but I just didn't see him at all. Anyway, we're going to the desert. That's where the objective is. Pretty sure I need to actually run into him earlier in the game to engage a rather important side quest for some of the, for at least one of the endings. And I didn't actually save like I should have. There we go. I have saved. Now if I die, I can come back here. Well, where's this giant ass machine you was talking about, Pod? Pretty sure if it was a giant ass machine, I'd be able to see it. Okay, there we go. Those are some big boys. Very much worth destroying, I can tell you that much. I do like destroying the big guys. They usually drop a nice bunch of stuff. You're about to fire a laser out of your ass. And you done went pounded the ground. That's fine and dandy. Switching your big arms and your legs around to change up your weaknesses and shit. And when your legs are all electric-y, I can't go smacking you with my sword because then I'd go hurt myself. But that's fine. I can charge up some big-ass lasers and punch holes clean through you to let the sun shine through. So there. You got lasers in you. And you got your legs being all big, which means you're a lot more vulnerable to being shot. So I can work with that. And while you're firing off your laser in the wrong direction, here's some choppies for ya. And you're done. He done went to explode dead. Or he's about to go explodies. There he is, exploding all over the place. And now you done left yourself vulnerable. All right, go ahead and flip yourself around like that, why don't you? That's fine. It's dandy. And I'll just keep on chopping your big robo legs and maybe shoot you in the legs too because those are the only parts of you that I can actually shoot right now considering that you got your arms being all big. Oh, you got your legs all big. So that means you're a lot easier to kill with bullets than you were before, and you're gonna stop being alive any second now. There you go. I like it when they got the big legs. That means I can just shoot them and shoot them all, and eventually they will die, just like a normal enemy. Except they ain't so normal because I got really big legs that can end up becoming hands. Ow. I got hurt. That wasn't supposed to happen. You ain't supposed to go hurt me. Now just eat the bullets like a good boy. Ah, now you got the big hands. And that means shooting you ain't such an effective strategy anymore. And you done smacked me upside the head. How so mean can you be? Goliath, class. That was over before it started. Negative. Enemy machines remain in the area. You don't say. Okay, yeah, that's a Goliath class monster. Probably shouldn't stand in the middle of it when it's all curled up. To be a Hegel. Life form that has adapted to the desert environment. Proposal: destroy the enemy machine. Yeah, that's real helpful. So yeah, I'll go ahead and destroy the shit out of this enemy machine. While I got the chance, but ooh, lasers, speaking lasers, lots of bullets. Time to bust out B mode. B mode. The use of B mode to increase nuclear fusion output carries unacceptable levels of risk. Defensive uh -huh. boost is offset by lower defense and increased maintenance costs. The feature was removed from newer models for this reason. Uh -huh. Guess it's too bad I'm not a newer model. Yep. A two did run off. 
before. So yeah, this is... And... There we go. That's B mode for ya. It takes the place of your fucking self-destruct. But, yep. Alright. Now. Alright, good. I came out of B mode. Such as that your hot A2 are not equipped with ranged weaponry. Proposal. Unit A2 should take advantage of her support pod, which is equipped with helpful long-range attack features. Yeah, that's what Don't I've been doing. Patronize me. I like long-range attack features. It helps me kill things without having to get all up inside of them. And you're sweeping your lasers. Ooh, balls. Lots of balls. They do have a lot of balls coming in here. Uh, her, 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 her. Too many shit going on. I don't remember which ball I was attacking. Unless I already killed the ball I was attacking, in which case it's all good. Now... Do you have one less ball on you? I don't think you do. If you did... Okay, there's that ball that I was wailing on. So... Oh god, I hit the fucking wall. I couldn't go around him to avoid getting shot because of invisible walls, and I can't see so much shit happening. You stop with the damn lasers. Please, that's enough of the damn lasers. And will just wear you down and try and figure out which ball is closest to being killed because I don't know if I finished off that ball I was focusing on or not. Now stop sweeping lasers everywhere, please. Dude, I really wish I could hack this dude like I could with 9S, but A2 ain't 9S. So... All I can do is run, shoot, and hopefully not die. Because I really don't like dying. Dying don't feel good. Come on, split your balls up. And I'm gonna go after this one right here. Because he is close to... Close enough to get all slicey up. Too many shits happening at once. I don't know what the hell is going on, but apparently I'm not getting hit. And that is good. Because getting hit is very bad. So, just shoot you full of holes. All I can do, run around and shoot. Shooty McShoot shoot. And charge up some nice lasers for you. See how you like getting lasered. Yeah. Not so good now, is it? with all the lasers happening. Son of a bitch. Why with all the shit coming from off screen and all the fucking lasers happening? Please stop with all the insane bullshit. I want to see what's happening and kill effectively. You really need to not be such a prick. There, that one. That one's got low health. I want to finish you off real quick like. And I saw you getting pushed by your other ball friend. Don't think I didn't notice that. Oh, fucking lasers. Stop the lasers. No more lasers. I protest your lasers. And I raise you some bullets to the fucking brain. And I'll get you eventually. Yeah, that ball right there. It's close to being done. If I can finish it off. That would be great. And, all right. Okay, so that ball is out of health and it's shielding itself. Which means we're making progress. So, yeah. So maybe that ball will become less of a pain in the ass. Or perhaps an even bigger pain in the ass now that it's all shielded. But you ain't so shieldy now anymore that you've retracted into the main body now are you all we can do is just keep on focusing on killing what I can kill while I have the opportunity to kill it and then I'll go trip it over a little piece of these ruins while I'm dashing about and really wish I could see what the hell was going on but 
Just deal with what I got. All I can do is deal. And Hegel, you will you're about halfway done. Now, this ball right here, it's got lowest health and it ran outside the fucking boundaries. You coward! Stay in the boundary so I can slice you up and shit. Now, alright. This is fucking annoying. Quit shooting things! Y'all really need to chill the fuck out. And I noticed one of your balls still hasn't returned to your body. That shielded one that I went disabled already seems perfectly content staying on the ground. Now, if y'all just were to do that and stop rolling all over the place, I'll be able to finish y'all off nice and easy. Stop with the lasers. Okay. Sweepy lasers is very annoying. I see you're rolling around down here, mister. Not attached to your main body. So that's good. Eh. Ah, fucking didn't need to do that, but I did it anyway, because fucking why not? Oh, doy. Do -do -do -do. That's the fucking edge. Let me by, please. I want to get by you and not get wedged up into a very small corner that I can't maneuver in. It's really unfair that you can just... That you are capable of going outside of the boundaries, but I am not. It doesn't matter. I'll still get you, though. Come on. Just... Yeah, you're... Oh, fuck off. I got hit by nothing. Nothing! There we are. Powerful lasers blasting holes into your face. And we'll just focus on finishing off this ball. And maybe eat a few thousand lasers while I'm at it. Alright, that ball's done. Yeah, you've got noticeably fewer balls attached to you now. And I want that one. That's the one that I want to take down. So, let's just... Oh, fucking sweepy lasers. Stop sweepings. I want to kill you. And then you did the fucking laser thing. I... Yeah. Now, alright. Maybe I can shoot that ball off before it even drops to the ground. Maybe. Come on, shoot the ball. Shoot him in the balls! Eh, he's too far away now. Instead, I will focus on this one. You seem very focus onable. Oh boy. I'll just run around, charge up my laser, and boom. There we go, that hit multiple targets. That's why I like the laser. Now, finish off this ball quick. Come on, fall off. Fall off, damn you. Fall off, baby, fall off. Why are you still attached? I distinctly asked you to fall off. All right, there we go. Another one down. It's getting less chaotic now that there's fewer balls rolling around shooting. And I have been lasered, but it's fine. Plenty of healing items. Yep, it's all you gotta do is keep your healies going. And come on, fall off. I was shooting at the wrong damn ball. But it doesn't matter. Each ball is equally valid. There is no such thing as the wrong ball. Alright, that one's done. And you only got three left. And let's make that two. So you're done. And I'll finish you right quick. Ah, uh, you went up into the air again. But yes, this is a lot more manageable now that there's fewer balls rolling around shooting me. All right. That one's down, and now you just drop to the ground. And maybe don't hang out outside the damn boundaries of the arena, please. And all right, good. You're fucked now. So much balls. Oncoming EMP attack detected. Well, shit. Escape recommended. Well, too bad for you, I ain't taking that advice. 
Where am I? The EMP attack appears to have caused hacking damage to Unit A2's memory modules. <laughs> so this is my memory area. But why are you here? Support units are required to monitor our target's internal systems in case of breakdown. <laughs> Next time, ask me before you go poking around in my head. Well, I don't think the pod had much of a choice in the matter. Now, let's just take out all your little shippy doos. And there. So, where's this taking me? Oh, even more. <laughs> What's all this about? The hacking has caused the enemy's memories to merge with your own. So, yeah. That was the robot's memories that we were just hearing. Made to eliminate mankind and thrown in the desert. So, yeah. Let's just see here. Normally, you'd be called... But we'll be called... Continue to observe the situation and dispatch it. This is a fragment of Unit 2B's memory data. It is an order she received from the Yorha commander when she was still alive. Hmm. So, judging from the information we just heard, 2B was not her original designation. And was told to dispatch something if necessary. is going to get out of your head because if you recall correctly unit a2 is not authorized to issue orders so there you go that's out of the way any more things i need to shoot that looks interesting i ain't your mama Well, that takes care of that. You and I are the same. We have no one to help us. We can only cry I and said scream. Shut up! Just shut up. Well then. Things seem to be going swim swimmingly for her, too. Oh, one, five, three. Commencing data sharing. Affirmative. Launching compressed conversation mode. Hmm. Yes, enlightening. Compressed conversation mode complete. Affirmative. Awaiting report on the effects of Unit 2B's memory data on Unit A2's self-consciousness. Understood. Updating as reference data for support activity. Hmm. Yes, quite. And now... We get to choose whether we play A2 or 9S again, and I think it's only fitting to switch back to 9S and, like, alternate between them. Yep. Unit 9S has destroyed the core of a resource recovery unit. He has obtained an authorization key in the process, but I am concerned about his worsening psychological state. Care should be taken to prevent Unit 9S from coming into contact with Unit A2. Affirmative. Likewise, this pod will take care to see that Unit A2 avoids contact with Unit 9S. So, yeah. Alert. Abnormality detected in vitals of Unit 9S. Proposal. 
Commence data overhaul immediately. Pod, search for the other structural units. I need to find those authorization keys and destroy the tower. Alert. Combat inadvisable during abnormal vital conditions. It's fine. Run the search. Scanning. All right, Actively then. Actively operating enemy large structural unit detected in accessible location. Marking location on map. Well, we got one out in the flooded city now. And, damn it, I keep thinking the map is the back button, but it's start. Eh. I'm trying to figure out where the closest save point is. And it looks like I ain't too far from it. So, I'm just gonna hurry on over there before I call this episode. It has gone on a little longer than it should have due to the way the game's shaken out. So, I will cut ahead unless something important happens on the way there. Alright, I've made it without any problems. And with that, I'm all out of time for this episode. So, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed watching. I hope to see you again in the next one. Bye!